What is everybody? It's GT Rick here back again with another kind of trailer react. I know these are new for the channel. You guys aren't really used to these. Hopefully you enjoyed the Mega Man Maker episode in between uh, the last video and this one, the Borderlands one, and this one. Um, now this is a game that was brought to my attention during the State of Play, the PlayStation events, uh, which quite frankly, honestly, kind of sucked. But, uh, I mean, you don't start off an event with an Iron Man game and then all of a sudden be like, oh, it's VR. You know, you don't start it off like that where everybody gets excited thinking that it's going to be a new... Iron Man game set in, you know, the Insomniac universe of Spider-Man. But that's besides the point. We're not here to talk about State of Play. That's done and in the past. We're here to talk about a game that they talked about years ago, and we finally saw some more about it during the State of Play, and that is Concrete Genie. If you guys have not seen that, we're going to watch it together real quick. It's a little less than three minutes. The game looks phenomenal. It's a PlayStation exclusive. There are There is going to be a VR mode somehow into this. Um, but this game, honestly, looks like it's going to be one of PlayStation's sleeper hits. Uh, so without further ado, if you guys haven't seen it, let's check it out together and we'll talk about it a little bit after that. So right off the bat, as you can see, it's in this crazy, awesome art style, um, which is awesome. Honestly, I love games that look like this. I, I mean, I love the realistic looking games too, but games like this um, are nice oh, just it? to. Your little coloring book? Give me it. Play and get your mind off things. Oh. Oh. No. Now, it'll be interesting to see, as you can tell, you paint the world in this. It'll be interesting to see if you actually use the touch screen on the PlayStation controller, or if it's like, if I'm a second son, where you turn it sideways and hold it like a spray paint can. Um, I'm sure with VR, you're going to be able to move around and do stuff like that with it. me to do that? To paint this whole town back to life. The fish market, that makes me think we might be set in Seattle. It also reminds me a little bit of, uh, of Epic Mickey, kind of, with the paintbrush, but that's about it. That's the only similarities I'm drawn to that. A terrible jump shot for one. It'll be interesting to see how these aspects work in the game, if you're actually going to control your character and which way you go, um, and how the jumping and other mechanics are going to work, or if it's going to be like a Sunset Overdrive style of game, um, where, you know, you're just button mashing to go from play, you know, point A to point B. That darkness will just come back here. I can't let that happen. But here's where the game picks up, and actually makes it look pretty damn interesting. It's like a drawn to life crossover. Um, but Concrete Genie is the name of the game. There's no release date, I believe, unless it says we're at the end of this and makes a liar out of me. Um, fall 2019, okay, so, so sometime later this year. Uh, but that is Concrete Genie, and it is a PlayStation exclusive for now. Um, and as you can see, it was all captured on the PS4 Pro. Uh, but that game, honestly, I think now, I'm calling it now, it's going to be a sleeper hit. This game isn't going to sell well at first, but then it's going to, and it's going to take off. Um, personally, I think this looks like it should have been more of a movie, um, a, a kid's style movie, which I, I mean would have been produced by like Disney or something in the style of like how Coco was done, um, would be kind of cool to see. But it'll be interesting to see what comes from this, if this is just going to be a one-off thing, if, or if Concrete Genie is going to be uh, a whole new video game universe. Um, but what do you guys think about it? I personally think it looks badass. I'm excited for it. Um, I haven't been excited for a PlayStation game for a while, honestly, because my PlayStation took a crap a while back uh, with that weird update where it brit consoles about last year or so, and still have everything back from Sony, so there's that. I've been playing my Xbox a hell of a lot now. Um, but I am excited for this game. It looks very good. Let me know what you guys think down below. I know I don't do these trailer reacts often, and, and it's something that's... Um, 
Uh, honestly, I don't want this channel to get bogged down by these, but if it's something you guys like and you enjoy me interacting with the trailers or with video games and talking about it more, then that's something I can I can do uh, hands down. We'll keep the gameplay, obviously, but if this is something you guys like in the channel, we can keep this going, too. Um, anyway, if you made it this far and you hear me rambling on and you haven't done it yet, hit that subscribe button. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. That's cool, too. And I will catch you guys at a later date. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you guys think about this game, though. Seriously, drop them down in the comments below.